Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Although this is probably the evening or afternoon for you by now. Watching a little bit of a Douglicious. Hmm, before we go to Schoolio's. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Poor JJ. He's so confused because. I know, buddy. Because it went from Eduardo, Andrea being at home on his own, right? And then all of a sudden, this thing happened 10 weeks ago. And like everybody turned up at home. Yeah. And then all of a sudden. A week, two weeks ago, Alessia and Eduardo just disappeared every day, and he's like, okay, I guess it's just me and Emilia now forever. Now Emilia's disappeared, and he's back in his own. He's like, oh, okay, so this is life. In two weeks' time, summer holiday starts, everyone's back again, and he'd be like, wait, what's going on here again? <laughs> he can't get, he's like, what's going on? It keeps changing. It keeps changing. Did you say acorns? Did you say acorns? Look at your hair, buddy. Look at me. <laughs> it's kind of cool, though. Okay, I don't mind my turby twist. It's still on my head. Um, but I just came across this that Amelia came home with yesterday. I must have missed it. On this side, it's people I care about. So who is in your bubble with you? So she's put all her immediate family kind of things, dogs. And then um, who else do you care about and wish were in your bubble or like... In smaller bubbles, but here she's put Erica, Emma, Oma, Omi, Austin, Kira, Chloe. I'm not sure what that one is. I think that's Dylan, Grandma, Farka. It's so cute. It's like all her cousins and like her aunts and my mom and my granny. And it's just so sweet. It almost made me cry the fact that she put Omi there and Farka there, who obviously aren't with us anymore. Jonathan and I have this. Um, YouTube brunch today. So, hope you've got your watermelon juice ready, Jonathan. Yeah? Oh, look, you brought me a chair. What is that on the chair? I don't know. I found it in the other room. I found it. to do. Okay, where am I? Oh, do I get the big. No. Oh, jeez, Louise. Here we go. YouTube brunch with Ben. Oh, look at him. Three days here. Right. This is going to be interesting. Stay tuned. I'm gonna leave it there. Mm. I need to push on. Okay, um, so I don't know update you because of what happened yesterday with the uh, the watermelon juice. I disclaimed straight away when we were on the call. I was like, just so you guys know, we ate all of our food yesterday. <laughs> so you might be getting some tweets <laughs> about it. But it was kinda cool though, you know, it was a lot of um you know, a lot of OG YouTubers, YouTubers who have been on the platform for a long time, you know, it's kind of cool to see everyone because normally these are all the people that we see at like, you know, we share elevators and cars in like VidCon and Playlist and Summer in the City and like all those different events and stuff. So I haven't seen most of these people in like a long time um, because obviously for the last like year or two years has it been since we used to do all the conventions. Um, and then obviously Ben, who's the um, managing director of YouTube in the UK, and then a lot of the support people from YouTube. But it's kind of cool. But we didn't get in trouble for eating, although we did a we did a quiz. It was kind of cool. We did this quiz with our phones, and um, and there was one point where I was leading the quiz, and I was like, "Go on," you know what I mean. But uh, unfortunately, um, I didn't win in the end. Okay, because uh, it's really hard. You know, it's like. Your, YouTube is mad, like I know my bubble of YouTube, right? And then like I watch like, specifically, um, I watch a lot of like, um, factual, I don't know how to explain it, like, you know, I, I watch a lot of car guys, I watch a lot of farming stuff, I watch a lot of gaming stuff. They're like my three kind of main like areas of YouTube that I watch. Also, another thing, <laughs> that I, every day there's always another thing, you know what I mean? We need to, we need to start like, um, uh, the addressing and, and context um, edition of the video. It's just like the director's cut at the end of the video. You get another one. Okay, we got that letter from uh, the White House, uh, the thing from the US. You know, I showed it because I was like, that's just crazy. You know what I mean? I, just saw, I thought it was mad. That it was like, that's so interesting um, for a lot of people who have no idea of stuff. Like, we, we get stuff from the Irish government all the time. We get stuff from the UK government all the time. We get stuff from the American government all the time. And I just think, hey, it's so unique that we're in a unique position that 
you know, we're all kind of like spread out among us. But anyway, look, I'm just going to have to take away all the important bits. But do you know how much money they sent Anna? This is how much Anna got, okay? $66, okay? People were making it out like Anna got thousands of dollars, like $66. In fairness, we're also probably never ever going to cash this check. So I look forward to seeing what the next thing I need to address is. Okay, that is all. On with the vlog. I am heading out to pick up Alessia. And it's raining again. What is this, June? Wake up, June. This is like, not okay. This is not a June situation. It's, again, I'm not wearing appropriate footwear in the slightest. Not appropriate. Espadrilla is in the rain. No bueno. I am, however, gonna try not to lose the camera this time. And no, I don't have a camera tripod on. And I apologize for that. But look, I just managed to get myself a ring light, folks, okay? And it's 2020, and I've been doing this. YouTube job for the past 12 years. It's gonna scratch, isn't it? It's gonna scratch. Wait for it. Wait for the sound. Oh, it didn't. <laughs> I've been doing this job for what, 12 years? Just managed to get myself a ring light. What makes you think that I'm the type of person to have a tripod in my car? Just what makes you think that? Because I'm not the type of person to have a tripod in my car. <laughs> I'm like old, old school YouTube. It's so funny because we had that um, YouTube chat thing this morning and there was a quiz and it was so funny because it just sh we're gonna lose each other. It just shows you how like, so it was kind of YouTube trivia or whatever um, and a lot of it was kind of pertaining to like a very broad spectrum of YouTubers so like I was on there Jonathan was on there um, Dan and Phil who I know who they are but I, I don't think I've ever watched and that's n nothing against them but I just I watch a different type of YouTube right there was like sports guys on there never watched a sports video on YouTube in my life um, and it's just so interesting how like there's gamers like do I look like a gamer person to you? No. I'm kind of up in the like I would say I, I probably know more about like beauty YouTubers and stuff but even that like I'm very like I know like the old school ones like Lauren Luke, Ellen Blair, Candy Johnson, um let's see uh it's Judy's, it's Judy time, it's Judy's life, it's Judy time, that's the, the beauty channel. <laughs> See, I don't even know that, and I, and I know Judy, and I love her channel. Um, I, there's so many more that I'm missing, but you get the idea. But I'm probably not like today's beauty YouTuber kind of like realm, I don't even really know about, like I don't know a lot of the up and coming ones, I'm just not very clued in. But then I'm still a big YouTube fan. Like I consume a lot of YouTube, but the videos that I watch genuinely, like if you guys actually looked at my history, you would just be, you would be shook. It's what you would be. Cause it's so all over the place and it's so probably not what you would expect. <laughs> but I enjoy YouTube. And it was just so funny. Cause like I was, I did terribly, um, in the, the game, the, the trivia game, because I just don't have a broad knowledge. But like, kudos to people that do, because that's just, it's hard like to, to have that broad of a spectrum of knowledge of like YouTubers. But it's just funny to me that like, there are so many different genres and like, you could be an expert in like, one area of YouTube and yet not know a thing about another area. Like just because you're a YouTuber doesn't mean that you know every YouTuber. It doesn't mean that you know like all of these other vlogs. Like sometimes people will be like, oh, I met this vlogger. You probably know them. And then they'll say this like random name and I'm like, 
I have no idea who that is and had a lot more knowledge in some areas than I did but he consumes a completely different side of YouTube to me right now like I said if you looked at my history it actually right now it's very different because I'm following this case that's in America so it's all like legal stuff and like news stories from Idaho which is so random in any other time but because of what's going on right now but because of what's going on right now over there that's just what my feed has been um, that and like other stuff too but I just have a very like you know I have this this one part of YouTube that I consume mixed with maybe one other part and that's it like I don't deviate from that um, but that's what I love about the whole platform I love that I feel like you know actually Jonathan said this when we went to visit the um, Prime Minister of Ireland he he made this point he was like you could love you know I can't remember what example he used I don't think he said gardening but it was something like that he, he was like you could be obsessed with gardening or you know something really random and go on YouTube and find like a wealth of information out there about that topic and that's so cool and you can find other people that are experts at it or that are just as passionate about it as you are and that is the beauty of YouTube so yeah very passionate very passionate YouTube girl over here okay I'm making turkey I'm actually making turkey meatballs again for dinner but it's a different type of turkey meatballs so I had turkey meatballs twice on the menu this week this time it's Thai turkey meatballs turkey mince egg whites um, chopped parsley garlic and a little bit of ginger and I think that was it and then I made a sauce like a kind of a marinade sauce with peanut butter balsamic vinegar sesame toasted sesame oil a little bit more ginger uh, some coconut sugar some hoisin sauce oh I've got flaked almonds as well so you sorry I forgot to say that so I toasted the almonds and then the almonds will go on top of the meatballs dipped in the sauce Okay, I've spooned over the sauce and now I'm gonna add the flaked almonds. This recipe is kind of it's kind of like making a cake or like a pudding or something. They make the house smell like popcorn <laughs> and you don't add any oil or anything to it. You just literally put them on a, in a dry pan and that's it. And make a good snack too. Alessia's favorite thing to do when she comes home from school is play with Play-Doh. That is so cool. It's like a bowl of balls. It's my birthday cake. Okay, you don't have to slam that down. Jeez. It's got sprinkles in it. Oh, and did you tell everybody that you're wearing Amelia's old clothes? No. Look, we've kept some things of Amelia's. I only kept like, because I obviously I didn't know that I was going to have two more. I kind of thought I would either have two or four and I just... Then, you know, obviously we changed our minds and our family grew and everything, but I only kept all the girl clothes from age three to four or like four-ish. And then the boy clothes I have from two to three. So Andrea actually got luckier because um, I didn't know obviously if I was gonna have a girl or a boy when I was pregnant with Alessia. So I just started keeping all the clothes again. It's really cool that she can now have what Amelia had and vice and like same with Andrea and Eduardo's. Hey guys, how was school? Good. Yeah? Did you have yeah. fun? Yeah. Did you get wet? <coughs> it was so wet today, wasn't it? I know. We got soaked on. And um, my class, Same. all of my class and me, we and played and um, princesses and kings. And I, Eloise and me were the cool. princesses. And then we were supposed to go to white. But um, we um, we obeyed our father's rules. And we went, we dreamt, got put the night in costumes. And I was like, Charge! And we were running all around the room. That's good. Yeah, and we got the biggest area. Aw. Cool. How's school? Here, I have something for you. You need to write this card to Julia, okay? What if she's watching this and she can see him? It's okay. <laughs> it's just her card. Her present's over here. To that, I want you to write her name on the envelope. Wait, I'm not done. Oh, sorry. Look. Aww, that's cute. So Eduardo and Alessia ha are having a, um, they're invited to a Zoom party on Saturday. 
Yeah, it's a Zoom party. What's that? Like on the screen, on my laptop. But Rapunzel's coming apparently. So that would be fun, won't it? Right, Andrea's having his first ever cherries and he's addicted. I got cherries for the, um, for the kids for snack, well for all of us for snack. And this is his first time and he just <laughs> keeps eating them. Do you love cherries, mister? Amelia, why don't you try one? Just try one. <laughs> the fussiest child ever. <laughs> Come on, just try one. Go on. You know you want to. Look, otherwise Andrea's gonna eat all of them. Maybe we should give some of these to Eduardo for a snack, actually, for school. <laughs> he's just discovered his new, like, drug. And he's holding a teething toy, <laughs> which is getting stained. Do you not want to even try one? What's that? A teether. For babies. To chew on. Is when they're getting teeth. Mm, he might be. I just need just one more. <laughs> Good boy. And dinner is served. Hopefully, well, the kids didn't like this, by the way. Just like full disclosure, because people are always like, do your kids actually eat the meals that you cook? And I'm always like, yeah, they do almost all the time, but they don't like, like when I make Asian style stuff, which I don't a lot, but whenever we do, or whenever we get Wagamamas, they don't really like, wag like that's like their least favorite. <laughs> Um, so they didn't love it, but I'll show you guys. This is what we're having. The edamame rice, the Thai turkey meatballs, and I'm having courgettes, and Jonathan's having um, asparagus. So, hope you guys, I mean, <laughs> hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> you guys can't enjoy it, but maybe you can if you uh, make it sometime. <laughs> Jonathan's bullying Andrea because Andrea's trying to walk. <laughs> He's clenching his toes. He's trying to walk with it, spilling out his little people <laughs> in like, his car. Oh, oh. And he was like, I'm full daddy. I'm full daddy. I'm full daddy. These two little monkeys. Yeah, he's playing with his car. And she's like, got like a million hands. Like, <laughs> you went over here and you're not sitting over here with the fire over here. Oh, Andrea, you've got a lot more. Oh, I'm going to see the one since you saw the jewellery. All right, come on, boys. You go to bed. Boise, Look, Daddy's, Daddy's got another one. JJ. I'm pretty sure it's Boise, Idaho, Jonathan. Daddy, 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 Daddy. <laughs> yeah, I don't think it's Mayo. <laughs> uh, since when? You've got tons of jewels. Does Andrea like this, probably? There you go, Alessia, put your jewellery away, please. Bring it to your room. Don't spill it. No, bring it, no, 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 bring it to your room. Bring Andrea, it to your bring room. it to your room. What is that? All right. No, night, night. You're eating from his feet. Come on, into bed. Quickly. Quick. Oh, look, all your friends are here. <laughs> all right. Love you. You go straight to sleep for mummy, okay? Shall I leave the light on for you? Yeah. Yeah? Read the dark book. It's too late now. We have to go to bed, okay? But where's the dark book? I will find it for tomorrow night. I promise. Okay? okay? Love you. I love you. Night, night. I love you. Night, night, princess, Lessie. Love you. It's currently... It's currently 8.08. .08. Everyone's in bed. Um, my shoes got drenched today. These shoes, which, I mean, they were expensive, so that was kind of silly of me, but... Anyway, let's charge my watch. Um, thank you guys. I have my white strips in, so if I have a lift, that's why. I can't talk properly with them in. But, um, I'm heading to the dentist tomorrow, so that's exciting. <laughs> Literally can't talk. Thank you guys for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it <laughs> and subscribe for more and I will see you tomorrow.